Hello, I'm Josh Carter, Principal of Science Hill High School. The purpose of this video is to provide information to our rising ninth graders. So if you're going to be a ninth grader at Science Hill High School beginning in August of 2021, this information is for you. To begin, I just want to talk a little bit about our motto, Excellence, Empowerment, Everyone, Every Day. We want all of our programs, courses, registration, everything at Science Hill to follow that motto. We want to provide excellence every day to all of our students. And by providing an excellent coursework and an excellent curriculum, we want to empower our students to follow their chosen path in life. The next few slides we're going to show are going to detail the registration process for rising ninth graders. First, we'll start with credits. What is a credit and how many credits do I need? Simply stated, a credit is a course passed. Anytime you take a course and pass the course, you earn a credit. In order to graduate from Science Hill High School with a Science Hill Diploma, students need 28 credits. On the screen right now, you should see graduation requirements, and that details the 28 credits students need to graduate. As you look at the screen, you'll see students must earn credits in English, Math, Science, History, Government, Economics, World History and Geography, World Language, Wellness, Physical Education, Personal Finance, Fine Art, and also have an elective focus. And then beyond that, there are opportunities for six other elective courses for a total of 28 credits. Your counselors will work with you throughout the next four years to ensure that you take the right courses and that when your four years are complete at Science Hill High School, you'll have your 28 credits and a Science Hill Diploma. Part of this video is to help explain the registration process for rising ninth graders. I'm sure many of you are asking, how do I register for classes and which classes should I take? The best way to register for classes is to sign up for a four-year plan. On the screen right now, there is a QR code that you can scan with your mobile device, and there's also a web address where you can make an appointment for a four-year plan. The dates of those four-year plans are also listed on the screen as well as the times. Those four-year plans, you will sit down with a staff member from Science Hill High School, a counselor or administrator, and choose your classes for your freshman year if you'll uh, scan the QR code or type in that web address, you can sign up for an appointment. It's very important that all of you sign up for a four-year plan so that you can sit down with a Science Hill staff member to make your schedule for your freshman year. A typical schedule for a freshman is on the screen now, and you can see we take four classes a semester. And again, each of those classes is a credit. The fall semester is from August to December, and the spring semester is from January to May. And again, each semester, your student will sign up for four classes. A typical schedule, again, is listed on the screen. Uh, in the first semester, you may have Algebra 1A, Biology, World History and Geography, and then an elective like Visual Art. And then in the spring, Finishing Algebra, English, Wellness, and Computer Applications. That's a typical schedule for a freshman. Obviously, there's different choices that you can, that you can make but that's what a typical schedule will look like. Everybody will sign up for eight classes at your four-year plan meeting. We also have online courses available. Um, online courses are taken completely online through our program called Canvas. They are designed and administered by Science Hill teachers. And the one course that we typically uh, offer to freshmen is Freshman Wellness. And you can take that actually this summer. I mean, the summer after your eighth grade year, you can take freshman wellness online. And at your four-year plan, you can sign up for that course. I want to talk a little bit about a GPA, a grade point average. Beginning in your freshman year, your GPA will start to be calculated. Sometimes people get confused and think courses later in high school count more than your freshman year, but every credit you earn in high school counts towards your GPA. 
Your GPA impacts things such as college entrance, scholarship money, the HOPE scholarship offered through the state of Tennessee. Um, at Science Hill, we also have a weighted GPA. Uh, some of our courses are honors and AP courses, certif uh, industry certifications, um, add some points to your GPA. But your GPA is very important, and it's your grade point average. On the screen now, it should show you how to calculate a GPA. Every time you earn an A, that equals four points, and this is on the left-hand side of the screen. Every time you earn a B, that's three points, a C is two, a D is one, and an F is zero. So if we just take our regular schedule, for English, the student made an A, for algebra, they made a B, for biology, an A, world history and geography, a C. You see the points, so you add the total points divided by the number of classes, and that calculates a GPA. For a frame of reference, for a student to earn HOPE scholarship money from the state of Tennessee, they have to graduate with a 3.0 GPA, which basically means a B average for their high school career. So GPA is very important. We want all of our incoming freshmen to understand GPA because the credits you earn as a freshman count just as much as the credits you earn as a senior. So building that GPA and maintaining a good GPA begins at the very beginning of your high school career. Uh, we also want to talk about some programs that we offer at Science Hill. We have band, orchestra, chorus, theater arts, JROTC, and many programs in our CTE. We encourage our freshmen to get, be a part of, uh, of a program um, or some sort of smaller community on campus. As you're thinking about classes to sign up for and you're making your four-year plans, keep in mind you also have a counselor. Our counselors are listed on the screen. Our counselors are divided by alphabet. So just find your, you know, uh, the counselor that lines up with your last name, and that will be your counselor. They are here to provide you guidance and support and help answer questions that you may have regarding classes at Science Hill, but also preparing for college and career. Lastly, let me just say to get involved. Science Hill can be a big place and oftentimes people can be worried about coming to Science Hill because of our size, but let me just, I'll, I will say the one thing I've noticed at Science Hill over the years is there is a place for everyone. That's one of the beautiful things about a large high school. There is a place for every student to be involved and we certainly encourage you to do that through fine arts, clubs, athletics, ROTC. It's proven that if a student has more than one connection to the school, their grades, attendance, all those things improve, and we certainly encourage you to be involved. If you have any questions about four-year plans, how to schedule a four-year plan, if you have difficulty scheduling your four-year plan, um, you can look at our website and email Michaela Colley at Colley, C-O-L-L-I-E-M, at jcschools.org. Thank you.